What is it the kids say? In the mud? Well, I don't know much about kids' dialogue these days, but 11 games without a win must surely be the definition of in the mud. Let's see if we can put it right today against third place Tanta in today's episode of Homeless to Hero. <laughs> Hello, 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 people. Welcome back to the channel. It is me, Taylor Made Gaming. And oh my gosh, it has been a nightmare since we've last been together. Like I said in the intro, 11 games without a win now. We have slid down the league table like we have rolled a dodgy number on snakes and ladders. We have gone right down the snake. And so we need a win. We need a win today to try and halt this. But there is a little bit of hope because I have signed not one, but two signings who my scouts really highly recommend. One is making a debut today. I'll show you them in just a second. But first things first, why don't we get into the results? Uh, that have happened since we've last been together and well look at all that we was last together for that game there we was not the Z destroyers that I hoped we would be we then went and had a free free mental game against Al Nassar Sharif Mansour our youngster again getting a goal but then after that 2-0 defeat to Harass El Hodi, which even that, that was a friendly. So if we're counting friendlies, we are 13 without a win. So we lost that game. We then drew our other friendly, 0-0 against Pyramid Academy. And then after that, we had a 2-2 draw against El Sams. And then the game that made me decide to change tactic... We lost 5-1 to Makassar. It was a dreadful result. Absolutely shocking. We, we just were not in the game. And then since then, we have lost another three. We lost 3-1 to El Saka. We lost 3-0 to Nasser Mining, which was going to be the game I was going to bring you boys and girls today. And then... We lost 4-2 to Suez FC. So, yeah. Shocking, shocking, shocking performances all around. And then, if we have a look at what that's done for the league table, we have, like I said, dropped down quite a bit. We're now in 12th in the table we are 11 points off relegation. But if we don't pick a win up soon, we might be having to think about that and worry about that. But hopefully, hopefully, we are not going to have to do that. Please, please, please. And so, transfers. Let's go transfers. Let's go transfer history. The guy that is making his debut today is Mohamed Mayoub. He had, wait for it, a 100 scout report. So he was very, very highly recommended. And even though we haven't got any attributes, you can see why he was rated that highly. He's yellow for passing, yellow technique, teamwork, flair, bravery jumping reach and natural fitness so hopefully we can put him in in the central midfield and hopefully he can pick up some decent passes some goals and hopefully help us improve next up is Motaz Adele he is not playing today he's apparently suspended from his last game for his old team so yeah little bit disappointing that but he again came very highly recommended. And he is a six foot three, 17 year old. 
So he might still grow a little bit. But even if he doesn't, he's got good tackling, good jumping reach, good work rate. Might have to put him up top on corners. Might have to have him ch challenging the keeper or something like that. We shall see when he gets into the team. And so, shall we get into it? Here is the team for today's game. We've got Torfik in goal. Magdi and Sami are our fullbacks on support. Ramadan and Hani are our two centre-backs. And then we've had a bit of a move around in the midfield. Ramadan is on the left. Meha is on the right. Both wingers are on attack. Abdul Wahab comes into the centre of midfield as a Mazala on support. Abdul Hamid is a central midfielder on support. And Mohamed Mehu, making his debut today for us, comes in as an advanced playmaker. And then up top, it is, of course, the youngster Mansour. And we have changed the tactics a little bit. We are going for a sort of passing, run at defence, work ball into the box, be more expressive. And then in transition, we're distributing to the playmaker, trying to do it quickly. And we're trying to regroup when we lose the ball. We wasn't doing that before, so that might have been our undoing. But let's hope, let's hope these changes can get us a decent result today. Please let us get a win. I would give anything for a win. Here we are. We are into the dressing room. What shall we be saying, boys? I think we go hand pump fists. Let's go pump fists. Go out there and show the world you've got what it takes. A few of them are motivated. Now let's go along all the positions. And that seems to have worked a little bit better. So hopefully, hopefully that's helped. But just before we did go into the dressing room, you know the tactical screen you get before the games? All the different sections were red. Nobody's happy with this tactical setup at the minute. So maybe, maybe might have to change it after this game. But let's see. Come on, Coca-Cola FC. Okay, here we go. First highlight of the game. It's us with the ball, but we've given it away. It's gone to Kamis in a yellow shirt. Kamis with the shot, and thankfully that is saved by Torfik. Well, that's an exciting first half of football. Just that one highlight to show to you. But Tanta have dominated the game, as you can see on the stats. 12 shots, 2 are 2. 5 on target, 2 are none. 0 0.89 XG. Yeah, we kind of need to try and do something here, boys and girls. I'm going to go hands in pockets. I'm going to go, I'm not happy. I'm going to see if that fires these boys up. It's fired up most of them. But let's go midfielders, because Ramadan's a little bit unhappy. I have faith in you. That's not helped. Uh, well, Mansour's motivated. Ramadan is the only one unmotivated now. Let's see if, let's see if that's not going to hurt us too much in this second half. Here we go. First highlight of the second half. Five minutes in. Magdi with the cross. Mansour nods it back to Sammy on the edge of the box. His shot has been blocked. And now it's El Zadi to run with the ball. He's going down the left-hand side. Can he get this into the box? No, he can't. Sammy with a great tackle there. And now this is more like it in the second half. We've got more highlights now. Hassan with it. Back. To Gaber. Gaber goes over the top. Ramadan heads it out, but only as far as the man on the wing. Al Azab, he crosses it in. His shot is blocked in. Their second one is blocked again. And we do get that one away, but to nobody in the correct colour shirt. And now non stop highlights now. Ramadan with the ball. He's gone long, but no, their defence gets in the way. We just can't keep hold of the ball today. And now Mansour, 
wide to Maya. Can he run at the defence? Can he get a ball into the box? I have many questions. The answer of which is no to both. He goes to Sami. To Abdul Hamid. Sami again. Hani. Hani over the top. And Mansour's in. Mansour is in. Oh, he's taken forever. And well, it was offside. Mm. So frustrating that. Thought we might have taken the lead. Okay, just over 20 minutes left to go. We've made two changes. Reader has come on for Ramadan. And Eunice has come on for Sharif Mansour. Because other than that offside goal just now, Mansour has not done a lot. And we've changed Mahub to an enganch. Might work. I'm out of ideas at this point. Please, please let something work here. Actually, you know what? One last thing. More direct passing. Let's try that. And let's try hit early crosses and shoot on sight. Let's see if that, that does anything. Just over 15 minutes left to go now. And now we've got the ball. Mayub Abdul Wahab goes back inside to our debutant Mayub. And ooh, that was a risky pass there, but we've managed to keep hold of it. And now Reader to Abdul Wahab, who crosses it. Mayer's in space. Hit it. He has hit it, but it's been saved by the keeper as Faisal whips it out into row double D. Here we go again. Fawzi back to Gaber for Tanta. Come on, we need to get the ball off these. And now Adul has it. Into Fekri. Fekri into Karmis. And ooh, decent save there from Torfik. And now Torfik goes long. And well, to nobody in a red shirt. Might, might think about going two up top in a minute. I'm not sure. As Haney does clear the ball, but not out of play. Only to their winger, Fawzi. Fawzi with the cross. Into a door and oh no. 1-0 down after a cracking goal from Adele. Oh, why couldn't Adele just stick to making albums? Mm. That was a very nice goal. A proper nice volley gave our keeper no chance. And in fact, now we are going to go two up top. Mayub hasn't done a great deal. So El Sayed on for Mayu. Uh, what is El Sayed's best role? Pressing forward. Well, pressing forward, you shall be, my man. And let's see if that can do anything for us. Nine minutes left to go in the game. Adele with it. The goal scorer crosses it in and Torfik thankfully catches that easily. Like his name is Jordan Pickford. And now Torfik goes long and... Where is the accuracy? Absolutely nowhere is where it is. As now they are coming back at us again as we have just gone very attacking. That may have been a mistake. El Zadi into Fawzi, into Rizik. Karmis with a long shot. Torfik with a decent save. And it goes out for a corner ball. This is just non-stop at the moment. Adele with another corner. He whips it out. And oh, it's 2-0. It's 2-0. Is there a plural for in the mud? Or is there a next level up for in the mud? Because whatever that is, we definitely are. 2-0 down. 12 games without a victory. Ah, oh, not good, boys. Not good at all. I don't really fancy our chances of getting back into this. What can we do? Focus play down the left. You know what? Let's go wider. Sod it. Absolutely sod it. Distribute to flanks. Uh, let, let's lower the line of engagement, but higher the uh, defensive line. See if that can do anything. Probably not. As immediately before those changes can take effect, we have got the ball. And they have cleared it. And now it's Ramadan with it. Into Hani. Well, that's offside. Penoy. We've got a penalty. We're back in it. Oh, this is big. 
This is a massive moment for us. Who's taking it? It's Abdul Wahab. He steps up and oh, 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 oh my gosh. The keeper's got his hand on it. It's hit the post before going in. But we've got a chance of at least a point. Oh, I don't think the keeper did get a hand to it, actually. But still, very, very lucky to get that. And now, Torfik, can we get can we get our way back into this? El Zandi, back to Faisal. And now Faisal into Fekri. Come on, win the ball back, boys. Forzi, Adele, Fekri again. And Fekri into Adele, Hassan. Come on, come on. Just We need, just need one chance, please. Fekri with a beautiful touch to bring that down. Now El Zadi, he crosses it in. Ramadan heads away. And now, come on, come on. Just one chance with a ball. Can we just get a hold of it, please? Oh, that almost could have been a goal there. But thankfully, we survived for the minute. We've got three and a half minutes of injury time to try and get this equaliser. Abdul Hamid. He's got a man out wide. Or oh, oh, at least he did have... He's gone for the... Shot. What a goal! What a goal! Oh, my days! Walid Abdul Hamid. What a man! What a goal! I thought he was setting up for the pass. But no, he had other ideas on his mind. Look at that! Oh! No keeper in the world is saving that. Come on, boys. Oh, oh, 90 seconds left. Something is going to happen here. One of us is going to nick a winner. Hopefully not the boys in yellow. And here comes that corner. Adele crosses it in. Ramadan heads away. Eunice, play the ball. El Sayed, turn, turn, run, run. Don't stand still. Abdul Wahab, Wahab's in, Wahab is in. Oh, he, he screwed up, he's crossed it. Oh, oh, no. Come on, corner ball, everybody forward, please. Who's taking it? Maya with it. He crosses it in and that Faisal heads away. And now it's Hassan with it for them. I think the final whistle is coming any second now. El Zadi. El Zadi, come on. Yes, that, that's been blocked by our man, Hassan. And Abdul Hamid goes long again. Yunus, are we going to have time for this attack? El Saeed, El Saeed, get into the box, somebody. No. Oh, that's gone out for a throw in. Are we going to be able to take this quick? Come on, come on, take it. Throw it. Don't take your time. Sammy to El Saeed. El Saeed, back to Sammy. Mayer's in space. Oh, but the ball's not. The ball's gone out. And that is full time. Oh, what a last 10 minutes of football that was. We could have nicked it at the end. Wow. 2-2. Two -two. That was better. That gave me a lot more hope than I've had in the last couple of months in this particular save. And so, Tanta had 17 shots to our 6, 9 on target to our 3, but only an XG of 1.09 as compared to our 0.94. I'm going to go dressing room. I'm going to go outstretched arms. Everybody thought we'd get beaten today. And look at that, inspired and motivated. That is what you want to see. And so, that's where we're going to leave it. Thank you so much for watching. We're just going to see where we're going to come back and what that's done for our position in the league. But just while we are waiting for that, just want to say thank you for watching. If you have enjoyed this video, pop a massive thumbs up down below. Subscribe to the channel for more Football Manager 21 content, Total Extreme Wrestling content and Bus Simulator content. And also, I've got an experiment coming, possibly tomorrow. If not tomorrow, then Friday. 
I've got an experiment you'll be very interested in. And so just before we do go, that leaves us in 12th in the table. Still 11 points off the drop. So maybe might have to start worrying about that. Not quite sure just yet. Hopefully not. And so let's see, where are we going to come back? We haven't got that many games left, to be fair. I think we come back for the last game in March. I think we come back for the game against El Merica Port Said. So, yep, guys, that's where we're going to leave it for today. Um, like I said, subscribe for more videos. Follow me on Twitter, at TaylorMadeGaming. I shall see you next time. Bye.